morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you are while you're watching this today. I've just done uh, some yoga and I'm making some breakfast, so it's like the oats, the raisins, cinnamon, banana, soy milk, and a bit of spice loaf with jam or peanut butter. But I wanted to show you something that I've got in my hand. The groundskeeper just dropped this off. One of the groundskeeper, groundskeepers, this to us. This is massive, like it's nearly the size of my head. <laughs> it's huge. Um, it's quite funny. They call um, avocados pears here sometimes. Um, so sometimes he'll be like, "Oh yeah, I'll get you a pear." I'm like, "What? What?" And then he's like, and then I'm like, oh, you mean avocado? And he's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is still quite hard. I prefer my avocados a bit softer. So I'll put it in a good spot to ripen. So we're going to try and mission to Nanny Falls. And um, it's Sunday here. So the taxis don't run quite as good. But we'll just see how we go. The story goes that a maroon woman um, took some uh, slaves there to try and hide them. So it's kind of like a safe spot um, for them. So yeah, it's quite a cool story. Get there, we're just gonna catch like one of those taxis. They're kind of like a route taxi. Um, they just It's almost like a small bus. You would have seen us go on them before. They'll pile up sometimes up to nine people in a car. It's quite, uh, it's not the safest, let's just say that. So yeah, we're, we're out in sort of um, the castle district just by the police there's a castle police station over there so we just catch uh, one of those each to Port Antonio that's about 200 um, Jamaican dollars each it's 180 each if you've got the correct change but if you don't have the correct change then then they're not going to give you change and then um, we just need to catch a taxi one of those route taxis from Port Antonio to Moortown and that should be about 200 Jamaican dollars each so it's very cheap if you want to look it up um, the Jamaican JMD currency to your currency you'll be able to figure it out there um, yeah it, for us in New Zealand dollars is not too bad um, it's probably even cheaper if you're running on a US currency and of course it'll differ as to what currency you use as to um, you know but if you're living in a westernized developed country then um, then it's it's pretty cheap um, to get there then, once we get to Moortown, as that's the closest town, we'll then have to hike for about half an hour to then get to Nanny Falls. So we just got to um, Port Antonio. This is where we nearly come to get our groceries. We've never come here on a Sunday and it is so quiet here. It's really bizarre. Like, normally the street is just unwalkable. There's like cars everywhere. You can hardly get past anybody. But, um, it's so quiet. It's quite cool to actually come down here when it's quiet. I'm going to pop into a supermarket to get a wee snack so we can break a note and make it into smaller denominations. 